Werewolf by Night. It looks so spooky, so creepy. How would you guys kind of describe this story and how it really fits into the bigger MCU? How does it fit, you, Michael? How would it fit? <laughs> how does it fit? I think yeah. we got. Well, we know we can't really say a whole lot about how it fits, uh, <laughs> but I can tell you that it is from a Marvel comic from the '70s. So. You can do some research there. And it's kind of opening into a whole new side yeah. of the MCU. You know, we haven't really seen this supernatural world really be explored yet, and this is the first one that is kind of really bedded in that. What do you think fans are going to appreciate most about this? I mean, I've seen the tweets for months and months and months awaiting yeah, yeah. this announcement. I'm sure you guys have seen it too. I think that everyone's expecting this to be very different and very special and very unique. Uh, so I, I, I think that that's what's going to... I don't know, uh, let's see this new language that appears in this uh, new world that kind of, uh, you know, Werewolf by Night brings. Uh, let's see where it goes. It's, it's exciting. I mean, also for us, I think, I mean, it, we're, we're also still experimenting. No? Yeah. <laughs> it, was, it was great. Like, here we are as artists being able to then experiment, even in this big sort of commercial world that we're, we all work in. To be able to then do something like Werewolf by Night, which is essentially a big experiment, yeah. you know, and and it was a blast to do that. So to any chance you get it, anytime you get a chance to do that, you grab it. So how dark does it get? Like how scary are we going? It gets pretty dark. Yeah. There's a, there's a particular moment I just told you about this morning that I won't <laughs> give away, but um, towards the end, and there's just a particular little thing that's happening with the camera, and I was just blown away by it. And I didn't know that was coming when we were making it. Michael knew that in his head, but I didn't yeah, know it. I know. That's so I, I was so happy to share it with them finally yeah. because like all those things that they because they just have to trust whatever is going on up here and and uh, you know, I was just thankful they liked it. I was happy they liked it. And I'm just excited for the world to see what they bring to the table to bring it all to life. We we were so lucky. We had a wonderful cast and headed up by these two. So can't get any better. Before I let you guys go, what was it like to see yourselves as these characters for the first time? It's it's always uh, a little bit of a, uh, you know, I have to breathe in a little bit to, to see myself, you know, and um, and then I start to, to uh, slowly kind of forget in the best of cases, no, forget that I'm in it and I start to enjoy it just as, a, you know, as an audience and, uh, and then uh, I start to find out things that I that I kind of like uh, think oh my god okay okay I hope I get a new chance to do it again <laughs> because I'm gonna do it way better <laughs> I'm gonna do it better yes. uh, so and that's what's exciting also about this is that the world yeah. starts to build and and we hopefully will get a chance to, to uh, try out different things and, and see it in different settings and uh, I don't know so it's not a standalone series well, as of right now, it's a unique, standalone little thing we are delivering to the world. It's what it is. Yes, it yeah. is what it is. And then, and then we'll see where it goes from there. We'll see. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.